Hey guys, it's Alicia here, and this is going is going to be my last video for today. And I wanted to come and talk about archers, and then I want to talk. Reason I want to talk about archers, I feel like archers does deserve a WWE or a Universal Championship. Now against the current champions, no. But I think sometime before he turns fifty years old, I think. As I know, our truth is getting up there in age. I would have never thought this guy is 50-something years old. I was thinking he's about 30 or 40-something years old. Um, and thing, but he's getting up there in age. And I just think our truth is a true test of a guy who is still wrestling. And um, like I said, he's getting up there in age. And thing, and um. He's good friends with Vince. Now, I wouldn't say I would want him to use his friendship with Vince to get a title belt opportunity, but I think um, he is a 15 time, let's just say it, a 15, 15, 15, 15 time 24 seven champion. And I think he does deserve to go for other title belts besides that. Now, um, do I think it should be the universe title belt? I think R2 does deserve a WWE title belt or a Universal title belt. And I'm going to tell you why I feel those two title belts does will suit him better. Let me just tell you. Let me just take it back to his beginning of his career when he was in NWA slash NWA, now known as TNA. He, um, when he was there, he had a pretty good matches. He was sort of like being built to be the star of of the show and thing and he does what he does now and everything he still has the same moveset since then all right during that time i remember this particular situation he did call out um rocky steamboat and he asked rocky steamboat do why minorities like himself don't get the opportunities and he started mentioning Rocky Steamboat, saying he was a big fan and everything and stuff. But if it wasn't for Rocky Steamboat, our truth would have never got an opportunity for the heavyweight championship against Ken Shevron. Now, it was a pretty good match until it was a lot of interference, but our truth still won that. He's a two-time NWA, NWA, I gonna say he's a two-time NWA, two-time NWA, I have to say it three those many times, NWA slash TNA heavyweight champion. And he had two reigns with that back to back. And I'm going to say this. I really think um, WWE could do something like that with our truth with him winning the WWE title belt or universal title belt. But it's all about is, it's to me, it's all about the storyline and how they um, come up with the build up. But I really do believe R2 does deserve better. They only use him like as comedic and stuff like that. And I think he could be serious, be taken serious when it comes to these titles. But like that, like I'm saying, this is just my opinion. And I really do want to hear from um, some of y'all fans because are y'all ready to see R2 go for a bigger and a bigger title belt? Or just keep them as a 24-7 champion. Alright, y'all. I'm Alicia. Don't forget to thumbs up this video and comment below. And, yeah. Comment below. And subscribe to my channel.